Hello and welcome back to the Project Hercules Diaries for another exciting update on the gearbox. So the shed fairies have been busy, the hole has been drilled for the silver steel that holds the gear selectors and the piece that joins the two gear selectors together. So as a proof of concept and a trial, you can see if the gears can be selected or everything locks up. Now this is an undersized piece of silver steel because for the pilot holes and lining things up, that's fine, but in the final um, assembly this will be a nice snug fit with the gear selectors you can just see around here that this piece of silver steel is way undersized and that's because we're going to put a thread on the silver steel of the right diameter which means we've got to cut tap this plate here and if you go in with the right diameter there's nothing left to tap that's why it's undersized for now but as a proof of concept just to check that things work uh, and they do work when you get everything lined up there we go, it does select the gear on that side and on the other side you can see how the gear does get selected but mm, let's get this in the right place. The dog doesn't go fully in, you can see the dog hasn't gone fully home on that side whereas it has on that side and that's because this part of the mechanism is touching the plate on the end of the gearbox before the dog goes fully home. It's easy to remedy, we just cut a piece off the end of this uh, mechanism that holds the selector fork and we've probably got to grind a bit off the selector fork as well. This will need to be ground because the fork is very hard, this piece on the top is just mild steel so that can be sort of sawn off by hand and filed or done on a, a mill if, we, if we're feeling lazy or we want it to be absolutely 90 degrees. So that's a job for tomorrow along with putting a thread on the piece of silver steel that's the right diameter, tapping this hole here once it's been drilled out to tapping size and drilling this end. And then the, the final piece of silver steel will also put uh, a slot on this end and cut it to length so it can be tightened up with a screwdriver or put a couple of flats on and it can be tightened up with uh, a spanner. So that's where we're at at the moment with the gearbox. It's a bit of a bonus weekend because we were going to be at the Toad Rally. Uh, I was looking forward to that. I haven't had a bike rally for a while but unfortunately the great British weather has kicked in and the entire rally field is underwater. So there's no Toad's Rally this weekend which means it's a bonus to tinker in the garage with things like uh, this gearbox. So that's where we're at tonight on a Friday night. As usual thanks for watching and more updates will follow.